Hello reception. Right, now that we've read this lovely story, Norman the Slug with the Silly Shell, we've got a different job to have a go at. I thought it might be quite nice to see if we could try and make a bird out of paper. Because there's a bird in this story, isn't there? Looks quite happy now, but he tried to eat the donut, didn't he? When Norman was trying to be a snail. But now he's trying to be a bird, so that's okay. So we're going to have a go at making a bird using paper. Okay, so the things you need are some coloured paper. So my bed's going to be pink. And also you need some paper for your beak. Okay, so I've got an orangey yellowy colour. You will also need some glue to attach it all together. Some scissors. So make sure mummy or daddy has said you can use some scissors. And I've got a pencil and a black pen. And I've also got a big round object. So I've got some sellotape and a smaller round object. I found a lid. Okay, so our big one is going to be used to make our body of our bird. And our smaller one is going to be used to make the head. Okay, so first job what you need to do using the coloured paper that you want your bird to be so I've chosen pink you are going to use your round object and you are going to draw around it two times okay so you need two parts for the body and then you need to draw around your small object one time for the head okay then you need to cut out your circles so you should have two large circles and one smaller one okay you will also need from your scrappy pieces of paper is a rectangle shape for the tail okay so I've got my rectangle here or my oblong and then out of your beak coloured paper we are going to cut two shapes, two triangles for the beak. Okay, you might want to draw that on your own or with a ruler or ask mummy or daddy for help. Or you might even have something that is a triangle shape that you can draw around. Okay, so here are the bits that I need. First off, we're going to start with the body. So I'm going to lay one circle on top of the other as best I can. And I'm going to fold it over, but not to meet the other edge. Can you see? So it's made a flat, and that's both big circles there. Okay. Next up, what I'm going to do, now this is a bit tricky to show you. I'm going to cut some diagonal lines going up here, but only in the short flappy bit. Okay. And don't go right to the crease. Okay, so I'm going to try and do that. Make sure they're all lined up as best I can. And these are going to be the wings of my bird. Okay, and then you can pull them apart. So we've got two with some flappy wings. Okay, next job is with one of them, you need to open it out and fold your wings the other way best you can okay you'll have two hands to do this so it'll be a little bit easier okay okay so I've got one set of wings going that way and one set for the other way okay now on to my head what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my glue stick and I'm going to add a little bit of glue and I'm going to stick my one of my beaks on. Okay. And then I'm going to flip it over and put a bit of glue on the other side to stick the other side of the beak on because we want to be able to see it from both sides. So I'm going to try and match it up as best I can. Okay. Perfect. Okay. So you can see his beak on both sides. Okay. I might turn it around that way actually. 
Okay, and now I'm going to use my black pen and I'm going to draw an eye size on. You can use googly eyes if you want. So I'm going to draw one eye on this side. And then I'm going to flip it over and do it the same on the other side. Okay. There we go. Okay. Right. So I've got my body and my wings. I've got my head. Now we're going to do the tail. So the tail is this rectangular piece of paper. I'm going to cut some little slits in because it's going to be like the tail feathers. Might be able to get one more in there. So don't go right to the end because we need to attach it in. Okay, so there are the parts of our bird. Okay, so I'm going to open this one out. I'm going to add some glue here. Best I can. On the side that you haven't cut the slits out of. I'm going to stick my hmm, head on this side. My tail sticking out this side. So I'm just going to add a little bit more glue. And then I'm going to stick my other side of the body on. I'm going to try to line it all up as best I can. Always head to look a bit too different. I'll pull it up a bit. And then fold it over like this. And there we have our bird. There we go. Pretty cool, eh? So I want you to have a try at making that. Okay, you can choose any colours you like. If you want to, you can try bending the feathers one way and the other or you can try curling them a bit okay but there is our lovely bird from our story okay have fun i look forward to seeing what yours look like and what colors you choose see you later reception bye